Hello and welcome to Technical Skills YouTube channel. This is Shafaqat Ali with another video of Android development. This is Google Map application development series. So in the last video we have used Map View to show the Google Map in our application. So now in this video we will learn how we can use Support Map Fragment to show the Google Map in our application. We have two options Map Fragments and Support Map Fragment. Both are almost same, only few difference. Support map fragments used for Android 2.0 and above versions and map fragments only used for 3.0 and above versions. This is only few difference. So here we will copy the code of fragments and we will open our activity where we have initialized our map view code. So we will replace that code. We will use the fragments. So go to design and here we will add the constraint. So I will add the constraint from all side. Now here I will give the ID of fragment. So I will give fragment map. Okay, now go to main activity. And first of all, we have to remove the map view because now we have no need of map view. So here I will remove the map view and all the variables. And here we will create the support fragment manager, sorry, support map fragment. And I will create the variable. And here I will call get support fragment manager dot find view by ID r dot ID dot fragment map. Now we will use this variable. So here we need to typecast. So press Alt enter to cast it okay like this and now we will use this variable support map fragment and here we need to call get maps asynchronize so again here we will pass the context same like previous one so now we have to so now for support map fragments we have no need of all these lifecycle methods we can cancel all these Okay, now our support map fragment is ready. So now we will test it. So run the application. Okay, our application successfully running. So here you can see our map is showing in our application. This time we have used support map fragments. So this is for hard code values we have added in our fragment. So if you want to add map view in our fragment at runtime, so what we have to do? go to main activity again and here we have to change our frame fragment into frame layout so here we will change it to frame layout and time we have no need of this class we can remove this one and here we have to change our id into container okay now go to main activity and here we will create the sport map fragment and here we have to remove this line and here we have to create support map fragment dot get instance sorry new instance put a semicolon and here we will use fragment manager dot begin transaction dot add and here we will use container so r dot id dot container so here we will add the container and next we have to add the support map fragments like this and finally we have to call our method commit so here we will call this method commit so now we will use this method support fragments sorry support map fragment dot get asyncs and let's see it works or not so let's run the application so here you can see this time again we have completely visible the map view so it's working fine so in this video we have learned how we can add the map view using the fragment and also how we can add map on runtime so if you have any question you can ask me in the comment section please like my video share my video and subscribe my channel see you next video take care